this is Lynn Fitzgerald from We Love Metuchen, and I'm with Fran Brennan from Community Nursery School. She is the director of Community Nursery School, otherwise known as CNS, to many of us locals, right next to the post office. I am so excited to be here. Very excited to have you, Lynn. I remember you when you were a parent. Yeah. Well, I'm still a parent. <laughs> parent, of the, parent of little ones coming here. We are standing in my kids' old classroom from preschool, and this is so overwhelming and so exciting. And I remember when your kids were like, well, probably in elementary school. Absolutely. And mine were in preschool. Yes. And here we are, you're running this, you're running the school. And I'm so impressed. Um, tell us, tell us whatever you want to tell us about community nursery school. It's changed. But, but, but it's still sweet. It is still sweet and it's still a great place to take your children. Um, we're very excited for the all the new things that are going on at Community Nursery School. Um, in addition to the regular preschool classes for two and a half, three and four year old students, um, we also have extended day enrichment classes for four year olds, which encompasses um, Spanish, adventures in literacy, kids cooking, STEM and art, all taught by our very own CNS teachers, a wonderfully talented group of women. Wow. So you're, you, as a four-year-old, you can come here and take a morning preschool class and stay up until three in the afternoon? Yes, up until three. So we still have options of children leaving at 12 o'clock, like okay. a traditional nursery school. Mm -hmm. um, and then kids could stay until one o'clock for lunch in the oh. three and four-year-old classes. And then the four-year-old students um, can sign up for the optional enrichment classes in the afternoon. They're yeah. small groups, they're hands-on, and it's um, capped at 12 children with two teachers. Oh, okay, so 12 students per class with two teachers, that's wonderful. Yes, we want it to be a very hands-on experience for the kids. It's one of my favorite places in the world to be here. Um, this is like throwing me way back, but um, but it's a good place. So who are the teachers now? Who are the, like, the head teachers? and? Okay, so our head teacher for the school is Colleen Smith. She's been here for about 13 years. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes. And then we have Mrs. Williams, who's been here about the same amount of time. Okay. Um, Mrs. Giegrich, Mrs. Okay. Alvarez, um, Mrs. Roth. This is her classroom. Okay. Um, Mrs. Farrell and Mrs. Joyce. There are there are lead teachers for the classrooms. And everybody had their children go here. So oh. It's a family environment. We all had our kids go here, and we've chosen to work here as a career. Yeah, no, it, absolutely. I'm so excited to, to see you here as the director and the changes you've implemented, just um, you know, keeping everything so nice and, and family and caring in the small classrooms, but incorporating things that we just really need as busy parents. You know, We, um, we try to be flexible. Um, we understand the changing needs in the community, so we offer um, flexible scheduling. Um, we, if there's ever a day where somebody needs extra help, we give it to them. Um, if they need to be dropped off a little earlier, we make accommodations. We realize also that um, there's not one program for everyone. Right. So we have flexible days. That's flexible, wonderful. And flexible scheduling. And you even have something called the, the – um the wrap, you have a K-Wrap yes, we do. from we Moss. So you're so close in proximity to Moss. And tell us a little bit about that. So this year we started a K-Wrap program um, for, for, our, for our community. So we walk over to Moss School every day and we pick up a few of the children and we walk them over in rain, in snow, in sleet. Um, oh. Thankfully it has not been a bad winter this year. Right. But we walk them over here and mm -hmm. then they eat lunch here. And then um, we have a theme-based program okay. that we run. So um, they did a unit on bats, one on spiders. They're currently doing a first aid for kids unit. Okay. And um, so they have still have plenty of time to socialize inside. If it's nice, we go outside. Um, we did a holiday gift giving um, theme where the kids made their own presents um, for the families. Okay. And so it's it's been very exciting. It's kind of like a work in progress. It's um, teacher based but also um, child driven so if they're interested in a topic the teacher will do research and then plan a unit on that wow. so the kids get to do a lot of it's all hands-on yeah it's always learning through fun or and hands-on learning absolutely I remember that when my babies were here yes um, yeah you know in kindergarten since it's only a half-day program and we have a lot of families um, where both parents work 
Yeah. Um, it it's an extra time boost mm-hmm. for them that they get to you know be in a safe environment. They know their children are learning and having fun at the same time. And they have lunch here too. If if yes. you opt for that, yes, they you do can have lunch here. Yes. Yeah. Um, it's also we also accept children from Edison as well. So okay. They still yeah. have a half day program as there as well. Right. Right. Okay. Wow. So um, this is like throwing back. So throwing me back. Um, the memories are just like pouring in. This is one of my favorite places in the world. <laughs> We're so happy. And I'm so happy to see Fran as the director. Uh, we've had many great directors in the past, but it's, you know, n- parents need these things that so much more now. Well, I mean, they're just, they're needed. And you've seen the need and you're changing with the times. Absolutely. To, to help parents with what their needs are, which, you know, is a little bit more hours at a daycare facility and yeah we also have a lot of grandparents who yeah. um, bring their children here yeah. the grandchildren here so it's kind of mm-hmm. a little bit of a respite for them you know unfortunately we can't meet the needs of everybody we don't go until six o'clock we we right it's really till three right it's so it's a regular school day pr- practically yes. so if they have uh, other other kids in the school it's all about the same release time right the and same the same time. schedule we follow the Metuchen in school public calendar right okay and also we have a lot of teachers who send their children here so that works for them that we're on the same schedule okay Good. oh right the school t- teachers public school teachers yes. yeah oh that makes a lot of sense okay well it was so nice do you want to tell us anything else about um like if they want to we'll put the your link Yes. To get in touch with you. Yes. Um, are there still availability? Do you have to sign up at a certain time for a certain time? So we're currently registering for September for the okay. 2021 school year. Oh. Um, this year we were totally full. So if you're interested in coming and taking a tour, we're happy to show you around the school. You could stop by during the school day or we could make an appointment. Okay. Um, we will be available after hours if it's by appointment. Um, we will accommodate you. Um, we realize a lot of people work and aren't able to get here before three o'clock. Okay, great. Well, I thank you for meeting with me. Thank you, And Lynn. talking about Community View Nursery School, CNS, one of my favorite places in the world. Thank and I'm you. so happy to see you here. This I'm is so, so amazing. They're here. so lucky to have you. You're, oh my gosh, amazing things have, have come into place here. I, you should all check it out. Thank you so much, Thanks. Lynn. I appreciate your time. No problem. Take care. Okay, bye.